Right, we're off to Walmart, but we're going to take you with us. Hopefully, this will be a long take. Um, but this is how you walk to the Walmart from the Rosen Inn International. Uh, or if you can find the McDonald's, we'll show you. Obviously, we're going to pass it now, but uh, we'll show you that, and then uh, it'll be it's easy to follow. So, we'll show you in a minute. Okay, so we're. We're coming out of the rows and now we've just come come out of the the lobby. Walking down and you can see, I mean you can see it there, let me try and get a bit of view. That's the world's largest McDonald's. So on the way out and you can actually yeah you can see the wheel at Icon Park as well. It's easy to follow this. Hopefully, I mean, we are going to get an Uber back because uh, walking back with groceries is not much fun. Um, but we don't mind walking to it. There's a little security box, as you can see, with somebody in. And you can see the, the, the new Disney store over the road as well. And the Circle K. So let's go down this way. I'm trying not to get run over. We've probably gone that wrong way. Yes, yes we have. Never mind. But yeah, as you can see, I said that a lot in this. Um, but there's the world's biggest McDonald's on our drive. And we're and the new Disney store. Let me, uh, let me zoom in on that. There you go. That's the new. Uh, or new tours. Uh, Disney store on our drive. It's really small to be honest. Oh, we can, no, there is a path we can walk. Uh, yeah, yeah. If you walk, if you're walking out, there's a Circle K petrol station. And there is, yeah, there's a path down here. We just have to cross further up road. So I'll, I'll just uh, show you where we're going, or where, where you're coming from. So, that's our drive crossroads, where the McDonald's is. So you come out of the Rosen. Hey, just met a chap. Uh, what's your name? Juan. Well, hi, Warren, he's uh, just come to say hello. We're outside the Circle K. <laughs> just uh, he wants to say hello to the vlog. This is... Um... This is the heart of kind of a Upper Orlando, uh, Lower Kissimmee. I Drive has been here for a long time. If you're hungry, go to Denny's. If you're going to Walmart, go that way. There's the Whole Foods. This is the center almost of Orlando slash Kissimmee. From here, the highways and byways, people tourist here. It's, all, it's just tourists. This is why we love it. We love uh, International Drive. Yeah, it's not bad. You can get a tattoo, you can get a vape. <laughs> get, get whatever you need here. Yeah. And the breakfast. And then some. <laughs> See you guys. Right, nice to meet you. You Thank take you. it easy. Okay, so here we go. We're going to carry on wandering. Um, take, take your lake road we're off to. Um, but you, you can get all the way up. Um, on either side. Uh, so, yep, it's going to be fun probably won't talk a deal because we're just going to be walking until we get to places where you need to see and that's the bridge that's the I-4 bridge so the I-4 is going across the top of it uh, and you need to be underneath it obviously if you're coming from the uh, point Orlando you'll be on the other side of the road and it's probably easier that way but We've changed it up a gear. <laughs> we've uh, we've gone to the international. Oh, nice of Warren to come and say hello. Nice, friendly people. I thought he might have worked at the Circle K, but it turns out he's uh, he's delivering with his missus. He goes to DoorDash. He works for DoorDash, sir. So there you go. Make sure you press this because it's like uh, yeah, it's a bit. Mentally, because they can turn 
right on a red light uh, which if you don't know um, it's a bit of a shock <laughs> but yeah when it's a red light if there's, no, if there's traffic coming it can turn right so just keep your wits about you something we did find out as well the warm up uh, used to be 24 hours um, it's not anymore it's uh, close, I think it's 6am till 11pm it's still a big uh, a big window you probably can't hear a word under it so I'll stop talking until we get past Yeah, it will be fine. I remember looking at this uh, on the map before. Uh, yeah, we did. We did do what we did. One, I have had a look on. Wow, it's so noisy. I know it's a motorway type thing. But... So yeah, uh, this one's a run for your life crossing, but it's not too bad. Nothing coming, fine. And we'll follow it down to the uh, you'll see in a minute. The, there's another run for your life crossing by the looks of it. And where the uh, traffic lights are, that's where we cross. Yeah. There is a cross. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we cross at the traffic lights, I think. So we get it. It is one way, so it shouldn't be too bad. I think those lights are on red. Right, okay, let's go. You can see it. There, there's a little... A countdown timer. If you really want to, I mean, thanks, Mr. FedEx. If you really want to, you can actually walk to Universal. Uh, that might be something we're going to do, so we'll uh, we'll see. But at the moment, we're not. We want to be. Oops. Don't want to get run over. Uh, we want to be here and down there, so we're going to cross here. Uh, head down Turkey Lake Road. I think there's one to press. Yeah, there's one to press here, so it's not a, it's not as scary as it looks. Press that one. And rough over the road. And if you've seen the old vlog. This cuts out the shop. So. Yeah, this cuts out the shopping mall, so you can see the whole foods there. we on the previous vlog we walked down that way. Um, through the shopping mall. We're not gonna bother with that today. Obviously, because we don't want to go back on ourselves, so we're gonna actually walk down to the lake. <laughs> Wow. So everything, there we go, a little white, uh, little white signal to run across. 
Well, not run across, but get across in a timely manner. Uh, and I'm, I'm a big lad, I'm not scared of big trucks. We'll be fine. Now, last time we can see the the Whole Foods. The annoying thing is you can see Icon Park. You can see the wheel just over the top there. Uh, but it's the I4. You've got to get across, and there's no way around it. You've just got to do what we've done. Um, there's an underpass at that bridge. That's pretty. <laughs> that's it. That, you're left with that as an option. But if you're at the International, rather than the Rosen Point, or anywhere up the McDonald's end, really, it's an easy walk. Uh, well, I say an easy walk, I mean, for somebody who can do your walking, you might not be able to, but if you can, it's, uh, it's a nice wander. Right, let's have a quick look, make sure there's no one coming. Well, there is one coming. He's not stopping. Right, here we go. Uh, yeah, a comfortable pair of shoes is probably needed. I don't know what it is, is it 32 today? Yeah. So it is warm. Uh, and like I said, we'll walk here because it's the first one and we're going to get a few um, bits and bobs we're not going to uh, walk back I'm not walking back with all the stuff I've got my backpack on but I'm not walking back with all the stuff uh, we might actually, I don't know, you never know um, we might walk back and do a vlog uh, walking back but if you really want to see us walking back just play this in reverse I guess <laughs> I hope uh, I hope this helps some people out. I do know that there's not a lot of folks um, out there don't you know do want to drive. Uh, and some people do, some people don't. When you factor in how much it is to park up in the in the theme parks, was it twenty five dollars in? Disney 27 in Universal something like that for the day it's just ridiculous um, we've got a Lynx uh, Poor Pass so I think it's $16 for the week and you can use it all over the shop really we got, we got around really well with it last year um, we've done it again this morning the one thing I will say um, is that we couldn't find the the uh, the app in the app store so what we did was download the APK um, I'll try and remember if YouTube lets me uh, to put a link to the APK that I downloaded um, in the description um, hopefully it will let me I, I don't know to be honest because it's, it's a third party APK but <coughs> it works for me works for uh, my better half um, and it's if, if it's, it's the only way we can find to do it if it's not available on the Play Store I don't, been just, uh, I, don't, I don't have Apple so I don't know if it's on the Apple Store but it's not on the uh, Android Store if you are uh, one in a five guys this is where it is it's not too bad just make sure nothing's coming this is where it'll bring you out yeah if, you, if you've seen the old vlog um, this is where it brought us out if you walk through the shopping centre so you come through at Whole Foods you walk straight down from Whole Foods and it brings you to this strip here 
and then you just walk to the end of it. Yeah. Um, and it, if you know, or if you've seen the old vlog, or if you've been here and you know where that is, you know exactly how far away we are, which is not very far away at all now. We've just got this crossing here. Uh, when we get to the end of this road, we cross over at that crossing, uh, and then directly over the road from there. Uh, and we're I think you can actually see the Walmart from there. But it's our first time back in a year. So it'll be interesting to see uh, if anything's changed at the little... It's like a little shopping precinct just before you get there. And we were saying before, um, we're not quite sure how they stay open because it doesn't look up. There were a lot of cars there, but the shops didn't look busy. Again, here we go again. If you can see that Sand Lake Sound Road, and you can see there the eye, so you can see how close you are when you're at the Icon Park or International Drive in general. We're not far at all, it's just as I said before, it's the Floridian equivalent of the M1. And good luck with that. So here we go, we're going to cross here, you can see the, uh, the billboard, it really is simple, it's, it's, it's very self-explanatory. Yeah, where, the, uh, where that billboard is, the shops, the little precinct starts the other side of that. Um, as I said, there's not many, uh, um, there might be, I can't remember if it's a Dollar General or a Dollar Store or a Five Below or whatever it's called. Yeah. But yeah, we'll walk down and you can see, be able to have a look. Yeah, and just definitely wait till that little man turns white um, from the red hand. <laughs> the last thing you want to do over here is forget the cars from, from, uh, from a different direction if you're from the UK. Uh, yeah, you don't want any of that. So I know there's nothing coming, but better safe than sorry. <coughs> I don't. Uh, we've only been here a day. I don't want to take any chances. Right there, you go. And again, just keep your eyes out because we can turn right on. See it like that lad there, it's just turned right. There you go. As it's on a red light, so just be careful. Yeah. Uh, yeah, go on, do you know what? We'll go through one of these meander lines. Get a little bit further away from the, uh, you're probably bordering my voice anyway, but we'll get a bit further away from the uh, road so it's not as noisy. Oh, Dollar Tree, there you go, it's a Dollar Tree. <coughs> so if you can see here, at the end of these shops, this little precinct, that's where Walmart is. So you can see how close we actually are. And we'll have a quick, uh, a quick look at these. So you can see what shops are here, it's always nice to know. So it is, I don't know what this is. Oh yeah, this is the Dollar Tree. There you go. We always walked on the roads and we missed it. Yeah, before. that's the hours. Monday to Saturday, 8 a.m. till 10, Sunday 9 till 9. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, it's because it's we, we didn't normally come in while there, while the, where the Planet Fitness thing is, we turned right in there, so we missed all these. So there is a liquor store, that looks closed. 10 a.m. Well, 10 a.m. Well, 1, and we're, oh, it's <laughs> half past nine, so there you go. But there is a liquor store here if you need liquor. Taste of Asia. Uh, Taste of Asia, again. Okay, that's 11 till 10.30. Um, I'm not surprised nobody wants that kind of food this time in the morning. The barber house, uh, he's open, there you go. Uh, orchid spa. Orchid spa massage, okay. Um, yeah, the less said about that the better, probably, don't know. Uh, it's an Ed, uh, yeah, it's a dead one. Uh, don't know what that is, but it's open. Uh, no idea. I've no idea. Uh, okay, Fairwinds Credit Union. It's like a bank of some description. It's a drive-through bank. It's a credit union. It says it's an ATM. So you've got drive-through ATMs. That's a bit mad. If, <laughs> if you, well, yeah, I suppose it's probably uh, you've got less of a chance of getting mugged in your car. I've got no idea. Uh, yeah, a place I've uh, obviously swerved. Uh, it's <laughs> an actual gym, Planet Fitness, if you're interested in that sort of thing. Uh, yeah, there's only one machine in there for me, and as the joke goes, it's the vending machine, yes. Uh, but that is open 24 hours a day, five days a week. But the closer I get to Walmart, the happier I become. Which is strange, but true. So, okay, so there's a doctor's, uh, well, a doctor's here. This looks like some kind of chemist, is it? Yeah. yeah there's a chemist attached to it. With, uh, again, you've got eight till six, one till Friday. So, uh, a Brazilian wax and spa, I'll give that a swerve as well. Red wings, I don't know what that is. Some kind of safety shop. Beauty shop. Again, oh, beauty shop for all. Drug. Yeah, but super druggy, isn't it? Uh, Ten till seven, that one. Uh, yeah, if you need any fake eyelashes when uh, when you're here, another barber shop. Okay. Monday to Saturday, Salon Spa. Nails. A nail place if you need them doing. Uh, to be honest, I think it's around about 80% of the people who watch my videos. Uh, yeah, yeah, this is more like my cup of tea. The wing experts, wing stop. Um, 11 till midnight, seven days a week. I can see us being back here at some point. Oh, I want to try as many wings as I can while we're here. Oh, is that one of those places where you can go and have different photos? Different uh, yeah, this looks like a photo place, yeah. Frozen. But yeah, as I was saying, um, about 80% of the people that watch my videos are male between 30 and 60 or something along those lines. Uh, so I'm guessing that we're, we're not all that, <laughs> all that interested in fake eyelash shops, but you know, whatever floats your boat. Uh, what's that? Med, med station. So another, yeah, it's not like the old England when you, you've got a doctors. Uh, if you want a bait. That's a vape shop. Oh yeah, that's that's got a few vapes in there. One, if you are a smoker and you are coming across here, vapes cost a fortune. Uh, I think that's GameStop. Is that GameStop? Okay, GameStop. Twelve one eight, twelve one nine. If it's if that's still a thing. Uh, another urgent care walking clinic. Get all your stuff there. I remember, I don't remember that being here last time, but it looks like it, I can't remember. But um, I remember this place, Tattooist, That's how, uh, that was here last time. <laughs> no smoking, no food or drink, no shirt, no shoes, no dice. <laughs> Excellent, I like that. And 
hardware store, obviously, buy some paint if you want paint. Yeah, don't decorate your hotel room, you'll probably get charged. Um, so yeah, and as you can see it, I don't know if you can, again, there's the Walmart sign. So at the end of this little precinct... This car park is bigger than most housing estates. Yeah, the, <laughs> the, Walmart car, the Walmart car park is enormous. Um, we have seen quite a few RVs, uh, you know, parking up overnight there. Um, I wouldn't recommend that uh, at all, but then again, I don't have an RV, so... Look, in fact, there you go, there's one there. You do you. And just, just to show you, while we're here, just to show you exactly where it is, you turn that we're exactly over there from Icon Park on the wheel. And you've got a right wander just to get here, but that's fine. Um, it'll, uh, even if you only walk the one way, it's around about, I don't know, $9 for an Uber. Uh, and if you like us and you like Walmart and you come here a lot, then it's, you're better off spending nine dollars having a, a lovely walk in the sun. Oh, that's if it is sunny. Um, we, we've been caught in Florida rain already. We've only been here for less than 24 hours. But we're heading for the grocery side. Yeah, go for the grocery side. Um, there is, I think, yeah, it's a McDonald's. I can see it. Yeah, there's a McDonald's in here as well. If you want something to eat, although. If you're actually going to Walmart, you're probably going for something to eat, but... Yeah, this is uh, my spiritual home. I absolutely love this place. Nothing like it in England. I mean, you can fit in Sheffield. We've got a, a Costco, which is probably the biggest shop we've got in Sheffield. Or, or a Macro or whatever. And uh, you could probably fit three of these, perhaps four in. In Walmart, <laughs> Walmart's fizzy pop aisles probably bigger than Costco. Uh, but yeah, that's just why I like it so much. I'm not going to take you around Walmart in this vlog. I am going to vlog it, but it's long enough already. Um, I just wanted to do a like a one take although it was trying to be a one take vlog until Warren got involved bless him but yeah we're uh, I wanted to show you exactly without cutting um, and making I'm not the world's best editor as you've probably seen but making uh, any uh, any edits this is exactly how long it took us so you can see from start to finish in fact let me just have a quick look it tell me how long what does it say 26 minutes this has been going um, again I will probably get out of the way of the, the car uh, I will probably speed some bits up where you can't hear etc uh, but yeah so from from the Circle K to here it's took us 26 minutes and we've hardly been running you know uh, so there you go I drive to Walmart. We're in now. Thanks for watching.